hello everybody welcome back to my channel and if you're new here please 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 subscribe to my channel like this video if you like what i've created and let's just start with the work so firstly i am using a toner and i've already washed my face after that i am using a serum which is from good vibes and it is their anti-wrinkle plus brightening serum which is great then i am using my all-time favorite indulgio essentials rose gold oil after rubbing that for good five minutes i will move on to my eyes and firstly i am just applying my concealer which will act as my eyeshadow base and primer i am using my foundation for this and this is the foundation from Krylon it's their Derma foundation which is full coverage so you can use it as a concealer also after that I am setting the concealer in place and for that I am using a eyeshadow which is very close to my skin tone and after I have done setting the concealer in place i will start building my crease up and for that i am using a very cool toned eyeshadow and i am just going um, back and forth with a very big blending brush for this the brushes that i use are from pack all of them are from pack they are my favorite best affordable brushes you can get in India then after I've built the crease up just to save time I've done one eye off screen and I will be doing one in front of you guys so to start with I am taking a magenta kind of sheet on my finger lids and applying it just in the middle of my eyes then taking a very small brush again which is from back and applying a turquoise color around it and I will completely cover the magenta shade from all three sides and yeah that is the hardest part of this uh, eye makeup this is very easy this is not exactly a halo eye look but it is a two-toned eye uh, eye look so if you're wearing a dupatta or you're wearing a suit you can easily carry two shades which are very easy to create so see I cannot explain every step I think it's just better to look and learn rather me just dictating everything so it's great for beginners who struggle with choosing their eyeshadow shades because your eye look completely depends on what eyeshadow shade you pick up so no matter what color suit you are wearing just choose those colors and create the eye look this eye look with those colors and you will look very good all you have to keep in mind while creating the eye look is that there shouldn't be any harsh edges no matter what shade you use it or everything should be just seamless so yeah after that i am applying my eyeliner and i'm not going for a fancy eyeliner because whenever i play with color more i want the attention to be there and not on my accentuated wings so I always go for a very minimal eyeliner whenever I have good colors on my lids. My eyelashes and my eyebrows are done offline. I have done not actually 100 but many videos on the same uh, previously so you can go watch them out. After my eyes are done I am moving on to my face. I am applying my foundation hair. The foundation that I use is from Krylon. It's my all-time favorite go-to foundation. And yeah, 
I use this as my concealer also the, the sponge that I'm using here is from Puna beauty store again cheapest and the best available so I will recommend everybody to buy that and after that I just felt the need of adding some shimmer to my uh, turquoise shade I don't know why but <coughs> I did it because I just felt like doing it so yeah after that today I thought I will change my concealer this used to be my all time favorite two to three years back and then I just completely stopped using it so I thought I will give this concealer a try this is the pro long wear concealer from MAC but after using it after many years I just realized that I don't love this concealer as much as I used to because maybe back then I was not so much into full coverage um, things but now I only like things which give me full full coverage so I know this is a buildable one but why to just layer products when you have things that give you full coverage in one layer if you are understanding me <laughs> <clears throat> then I am blending the concealer out and this concealer sets very quickly plus um, this was not a hi this was not highlighting my face enough so I used a very yellowish toned uh, concealer which is from pack over it just to give my face a highlighted effect and that MAC concealer sets very quickly so I use very little amount at a time blend it then apply it on the next area now i am applying my blusher and you should know by now that i don't use powder blushes as much i use my bullet lipstick and other lipstick as my blush and uh, i have applied lip shade off camera because i just uh, get very close to the mirror and then the camera doesn't focus there so you mostly skip seeing me applying lipstick then i've set my makeup with the setting spray from pack and that is the completed look you guys after that i'm just applying my mascara for the brows and this one is from abh i just go for abh products for my brows because they're the best ones and i i haven't used anything else so i can't really comment now to highlight my face all i'm doing is i'm just mixing a powder highlight which is from forever 52 and vaseline and this makes a bomb bomb liquid concealer and i apply it very frequently very regularly and i don't really get anything this amazing in the market so i generally mix my highlighters with the vaseline to just pop them further so yeah after that is done i am going with the same sponge and blending everything for the very last time and that is the completed look you guys i hope you like it and if you like um, these videos where i do voiceover please comment down below and tell me thank you so much bye bye